Hello everybody, welcome to the video and I hope you enjoy this introduction. <laughs> Just my name's Owen, you know me already, and today I want to talk about um, that we're, it's okay to say what you don't like about people's behaviour. Or even about people, but really about their behaviour, it's okay to share that and unconditional love or love doesn't mean that we cannot actually say what we don't like about people or people's behaviour. Um, unconditional love is is a freedom to express honesty and truthfulness. It, we don't have to lie or deceive to be loving. Um, but at the same time, I'd always like to share with you the other angle and perspective. And that is that we do not have to be mean either. We don't have to be closed-hearted, like look at the open, beautiful, expansive sky and the, the lovely berries. Wow. You see? So we can be like beautiful berries and the sky and the air. Open and inclusive. The air includes and surrounds everything. We can encapsulate, we can surround everything with our sense of love. And that means, so if we're saying it's holistic to be able to say, I don't like that like that behavior or this thing about this person or this thing about me or the other person. I don't like this, the way this happens, these qualities. And it doesn't mean that we have to be um, mean. To, we don't have to judge. And I want to combine it with another like lesson. And that is, um, not be, people, we don't know people's histories, their past, and people are the way they are because of a reason, many reasons. So it's not our place and we shouldn't judge. Um, we sh and when I say judge, it's like we should like to be mean, to, to look down on someone, to, to be cold or cool hearted, closed hearted, um, to condemn. So we don't look down or condemn or to have a closed heart on anybody. But it's okay to speak the truth. We can say, okay, well, I have an area here which I can improve and I don't like that about myself at the moment, which well, I'm changing it. And we can say also about another person, I don't like the way you or that person does that. Or like, I don't like these qualities. And sometimes people say, well, you have to accept me the way I am. And they're being belligerent and st stubborn and they don't want to change their negative behavior or their energy, out negative outbursts. And then what I do in my life is I say, well, you got to accept me for not liking that and I'm a, just as you're allowed to be whatever and unleash your words and energy, I'm allowed to unleash my words and energy and say I don't like the way you're doing that, like I don't like that. I, it's not nice or comfortable when you like just be mean or reckless or unmindful, mi unmindful or uncareful or unloving, you know, un uncareful, just like when you shed all your negative energy I feel it and like, you know, you don't tell me to shut up just because you tell me to accept you, you have to accept me having a response to this. So some people try and, like the reason why I'm saying this, some people try and tell you to, they try and close you down, control and shut you up and shut you down. Um, because they, they try to use the accept me uh, idea, the tool, but they have to accept you to be pissed off or unhappy with their corruption. <laughs> their like maybe possible abusive behavior. And that's the same now if you're being negative and someone else has a, you're allowed, to, they're allowed to have a problem with your negative behavior and um, you're allowed to have a problem with anyone else's negative behavior. And similarly, this is what I mean about unconditional love. Unconditional love means we don't judge, but we do, we are allowed to speak up. We have a voice and a throat chakra for every, for a reason. So we're allowed to express ourselves. But if, the, the, good, the good thing is, if you balance these two ideas, okay, or these three ideas, so the idea about acceptance and what it is and what it isn't, it's loving from the heart. It's like having a sense of care and compassion. It doesn't mean being a walkover. And then you combine, you combine uh, not judging because you don't know where people are coming from. So you try to accept them, but you also try and juggle the situation. You're allowed to express, you're allowed to feel, feel. Like we are emotional beings, everybody. So we're allowed to have emotions. And that's my primary message here. And we're allowed to express ourselves freely. And it doesn't mean we're not being loving or not being accepting to express ourselves and what we want, because we all have wishes and desires and emotions of how we'd like people to be uh, energetically, like friendly, kind, loving, compassionate, tolerant, patient, forgiving. Um, and we also can want these within ourselves. So it's, it's okay. 
it's okay to do that. Um, so, interesting. People are doing work on the river. So, um, I'll more or less finish this video with that. There's just one last thing I want to say. Um, acceptance, talking, um, judgment, un and um, and also love. So, angels and higher and God, for example, um, or source. Um, all of this can be cushioned with a sense of like love and care and mindfulness or love and care, you know, forgiveness and compassion. So we can either uh, ha fall back in love afterwards we express ourselves what we don't like about someone's behaviour or something, or some behaviour in the world like corruption or abuse or like slaughtering or anything that we don't like we're allowed to say and it's actually very good to say I, I feel, very very good, generally. But also try to remember the whole love, compassion, kindness, non-judgment and acceptance idea as well. And that's the holistic approach and that's the whole, the whole spectrum, that's everything included. And that's powerful living, it's like more natural, higher encompassed living. So I'll leave the video with that. So I hope this video has helped and uh, please subscribe, share, like. Leave your comments and um, check in my website below, ownfox.org or higherselfherbs.com for many helpful links, quotations, other videos, playlists and helpful herbs or um, life coaching of spiritual, spiritual life coaching. <coughs> and there's the ducks in the river. So everybody, I hope you liked a little bit of nature in this video and thanks for your time and lots of love to you. Okay, have a fantastic day. Lots of love now. Bye everybody. See ya.